people ask you when you're a kid, hey, what do you want to be when you grow up? And I said, I want to be a, an astronaut, a biologist, and a geologist. So, you know, when you're five, this seems totally reasonable. Studying microbiology on station is very similar to the Earth, except for you're floating. You may be doing the same experiment, but you're conducting it on the ceiling because that's a convenient place to work. We're studying things like sequencing DNA, what happens to the human body in space, and even viruses are an issue in space. I get really excited about things and something about viruses, about biology. I'm totally fascinated by it, and I want to get up and go work on this every day. Rubens became the first person to sequence DNA in space. With the addition of NASA astronaut Kate Rubens, these three are about to begin the first planned two-orbit flight to the International Space Station with humans on board. Space is both a place that is like this far off, almost fantastical thing that you think about and people dream about. But then on the other hand, to me, it's it's a home. I've been there, I've lived there for six months. You now I have friends there. I'm, I'm looking forward to, to going back there like you would look forward to visiting an old apartment. The moon is an incredible destination. We have been there, but we were there for such a brief period of time. Apollo, it united the world. And so to think, you know, when we're having dark times, to think of the fact that we might have people on the planet able to look up and know that there's humans on the moon and that we've done this as a joint international collaboration. I can't even describe what kinds of the benefits that might be, both for our partnerships in the world and just for joy and inspiration in people's everyday lives. Less than 10 minutes away from today's launch, this is Kate Rubin celebrating her birthday with a launch to the International Space Station. I think if I was going to talk to my younger self, I would say, don't be so stressed out about what you're doing at the moment, because it's such an honor to be a scientist and to be an astronaut. Just enjoy what you're doing every day. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more NASA content, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe on our channel.